Good morning and welcome to St. Patrick's Cathedral. We are happy to have all of you here to celebrate the life, the love, and the power of Saint uh, Cecilia Gentili. We pray that the grace and peace of God our Father, who raised Jesus from the dead, be always with you. And with your spirit. In the waters of baptism, Cecilia died with Christ and rose with him to new life. May she now share with him eternal glory. Watch your back, watch your back. Okay. St. Patrick's Cathedral, except on Easter Sunday, we don't really have a crowd that, this, that is this well turned out, you know? <laughs> <laughs> what we do is we move to a um, funeral service, no mass. Okay, okay, okay. Right? Yeah, sure. So after that, we do the final commendation, we go. Okay, okay, right. Right. yep. Good. Let us pray. O oh God, whose nature is always to forgive and to show mercy, we humbly implore you for your servant Cecilia, whom you have called to journey to you. And since she hoped and believed in you, Grant that she may be led to our true homeland, to delight in its everlasting joys. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Could the person who is going to read the second reading please come forward? We still going to show up as us. <laughs> and may Cecilia's community be loved and received and seen by each other and have access to life affirming health care and God's protection with secure housing. We pray to our Lord Jesus Christ, who was full of love. Yeah. Lord, hear our prayer. I'm going to invite the, uh, the three people who are uh, going to give reflections on Cecilia's life to come forward and be with us up here. Peter, I think it's you and, okay. You can. But to me, she was my partner. We woke up every day. We had so much laughter and love. And I'm going to take that with me forever, baby. <laughs> my baby. That's what we called each other every single morning. My baby. My baby. Y'all know what we're about to do, right? Repeat after me. Cecilia! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, Cecilia was born in 1972.
Imagine the shock and surprise. <laughs> but I got to tell you, there's something that's hurting deep in our hearts because we lost our saint. We lost somebody that we could call no matter what, no matter what time. But this lady worked so hard to make sure girls like me, girls like you, boys like you are safe, are grounded, are rooted, got health care, that sex workers are free. This whore, <laughs> this great whore, Saint Cecilia, mother of all whores, Today we say, we see you soon, and that you will give us the strength, the courage to continue your legacy, to continue the challenges ahead, to remain steadfast, because we know what we deserve. Love, equity, the same rights and a life of dignity. Let us stand and offer our praise to Almighty God and pray as the Lord Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Give us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Before we go our separate ways, let us take leave of our sister Cecilia. May our farewell express our affection for her. May it ease our sadness and strengthen our hope. One day we shall joyfully greet her again when the love of Christ, which conquers all things, destroys even death itself. Into your hands, Father of mercies, we commend our sister Cecilia in the sure and certain hope that together with all who have died in Christ, she will rise with him on the last day. We give you thanks for the blessings which you bestowed upon Cecilia in this life. They are signs to us of your goodness and of our friendship with the saints in Christ. Merciful Lord, turn toward us and listen to our prayers. Open the gates of paradise to your servant and help us who remain to comfort one another with assurances of faith until we all meet in Christ and are with you and with our sister forever through Christ our Lord. Amen. In peace, let us take our sister to her place of rest.